So just the one more millions race this week. Then this is leg three. Oh, quite a few long distance races this week though. So 0 to 140 handicap and the top one is Bayswater Marsh for David Robertson. Hardy Accord, James Shea, Pride of Oak, John Morgan, Shadow Player, Daniel French, watching carefully, Graham Clutterbuck, Watergate, Darren Thompson, Fifi, Paul Rhodes, Roach, Paul O'Neill, Whenever Dragoon, Alex Cherry, All Guns Far and Vinnie Gerard and Plyne Lukey for Martin Leadham. So 11 then. In this, the Moors Millions qualifying. They've started to be handicapped now, so more a chance for everybody racing towards the first fence then right in front of the stand and they're all over the first though the back two hardy accord are watching carefully did their best to get rid of the jockey early on they're passing the winning post they're gonna have to come around a good couple of times at least yet and it's just about pride of oak that's the early leader with organs firing in the green on the outside and tucked in on the inside watergate so front runner or John Moore in that pale blue as they come to the second. Good jump there, got over it nicely and leads by about a neck. So the green jacketed old ones firing for Vinnie Gerard on the outside. Then Watergate is in third in the blue with the white sleeves as they take the third. Already over three then and they're all still on their feet. Three greys in this. All towards the back of the field at the moment. Roach in the red with the green sleeves. David Robertson's Bayswater march in those turquoise and sky blue with a yellow cap and over that one they all go and then the third grey is Hardy Accord in those clashing colours which are either Hems or James Shea I think as they come down towards the fifth and they're all safely over that one then with all guns firing now the clear leader by about three to Pride of Oak second and Watergate third as they come down to the sixth over that one they all go, fences going up thick and fast, 23 to take it all in this race and all guns firing is the leader into this ditch over it they all go, good jump by Pride of Oak oh, two scrappy looking jumps at the back but they're all still on their feet and they're getting quite well strung out as well as the cameraman struggles to keep them all in shot they take this plain one and all guns firing skipping over that one really well, another mistake at the back by Hardy Accord but it's all guns firing still in the lead, Pride of Oak he's about three lengths down in second just tucked in behind that one is Watergate then a gap of about four to whenever Dragoon after that one is Shadow Player then Plyne Lukey in the orange then comes Watching Carefully and Bayswater Marsh with Fifi, Roach and finally Hardy Accord just the back marker so, pretty well strung out then. About a third of the jumping done. And all guns firing. Yes. Never up to his name at the moment. Leading by about three lengths to Pride of Oak in second. Watergate just being kept up to his work on the inside of that one in third. Those three. Oh, a good four lengths clear of whenever Dragoon. Jockey seems to want to get that one to join the leading group. Main body of the field being hit by Shadow Plate. One of Daniel French's many different silks this season. Blind Lukey just behind that one as they take the ninth. And they're all safely over that one. And Hardy Accord still just a back marker. Moving into the straight now then. And all guns firing is clear. With Watergate and Pride of Oak. And whenever Dragoon. Almost become a four now. And whenever Dragoon jumped that one really well. Got over that one nicely, and all guns firing is still the leader. Watergate and Pride of Oak together. Whenever we'll Dragoon just behind them, bit of a gap then to Plyne Lukey and Shadow Plate. And then watching carefully, and Fifi Roach along the outside. Making them up this straight again. Oh, the leader went right down on his nose there. Bad mistake, also by Plyne Lukey. But the leader was lucky to get away with that one. And has just about surrendered the lead to Pride of Oak. They come up past the stand here. This will be the final fence. Next time. And all guns fire on Pride of Oak disputing the lead. Watergate is in third. Whenever Dragoon is four, then I get back to watching carefully. Five and Roach is six and Pine Luke is seven. Then Shadow plays eight and Fifi is nine. And then Bayswater Marsh and finally Hardy Accord. So two greys at the back, all guns firing in the front. Takes that plane. Oh, he's gone! Pride of Oak's gone! There's a major surprise there. John Morgan's horse falling. And hadn't put a foot wrong so far. And one or two others had done. So you wouldn't have been expecting that one to go. And that's left 
all gone as far in a good two or three lengths clear of Watergate in second. Whenever Dragoon is third, gap of about four or five lengths, then back to Roach, who's now in the lead of the main group. As they come to this plain one, good jump there by Watergate. They're all over that one nicely. And all guns firing continues to lead. He's now thinking of moving closer to the fence, I think, as well. Inside rail. Leads by about three. Over that plane one. Jumped it well. Watergate second. Whenever Dragoon third. Roach jumped it really well in fourth. Then Plyne, Lukey and watching carefully together. A little bit of a gap to Bayswater. Marsh and then Fifi and Hardy Accord. Shadow plays now. Drop to the back as they take that play. One and whenever Dragoon's gone. Whenever Dragoon hit that hard. Gave the jockey no chance at all. He's out of the side door. This is a ditch. They're starting to tire these now. As they all get over that one. But all guns firing is still going well in the lead. Leads by a couple of lengths to Watergate in second. Gapper for good four lengths then to Plyne Luke as they take the 19th. The leader didn't jump that one all that well. Neither did Shadow play at the back. But Watergate is now coming up the inside to try and challenge all guns firing. It's all guns firing still in the lead though. Watergate second. Plyne Luke run on in third. Roach is fourth. Then Bayswater Marsh from watching carefully. And then Fifi and then Hardy Accord. And then Shadow play. And they're the only ones left as they make their way towards the next. All guns firing is running the lead pretty much all the way with Watergate on the inside. Gap of about three, then to Plyne Lukey, then two greys chasing in Bayswater Marsh, and Roach, bit of a gap back to watching carefully, and Fifi, the race is on in earnest now then, and all guns firing is going to have to repel Raiders, because Bayswater Marsh and Plyne Lukey are both run really well, so too's Roach, Watergate just being given a bit of a breather, watching carefully, is also trying to get into it, but we've got a new leader, it's Bayswater Marsh immediately pressed by Plyne Lukey in the orange, it's Bayswater Marsh in the lead, Plyne Lukey second, then Roach is third, all guns firing, looks beaten there, so too does Watergate, over the 20th they go, and Bayswater Marsh is in the lead with just three more to take, it's Bayswater Marsh by about a length, to Plyne Lukey in second, Roach is third, these three have gone well clear of the remainder who are just about headed now by watching carefully but it's Bayswater Marsh coming down towards this next they've got three furlongs to race this is the third last over it they go Bayswater Marsh from Plyne Lukey Roach still looks full and running in third Plyne Lukey now comes to challenge and Plyne Lukey takes it up it's Plyne Lukey in the lead from Roach who's gone second Bayswater Marsh has hit the wall they've still got two fences to take and two furlongs to race jockey on the leader that's a quick look behind see where they are and Roach is challenging. He's getting closer with every stride. Plyne Lukey comes down towards this second last fence with a lead of two lengths. Jumps it slowly. Better jump by Roach. Roach is beginning to get up on the inside. It's Roach down the grey. Roach from Plyne Lukey. They come down towards the final fence. And Roach is in front. Plyne Lukey is second. The rest are nowhere. It's Roach in the lead down towards the final fence. Roach makes a mistake. Plyne Lukey didn't jump it now much better. It's Roach and Plyne Lukey running on now. He's watching carefully. But it's got to be Roach that takes it. Roach is the winner. Plyne Lukey is second. Watching carefully. He's third. Then Roach. Gate was fourth. Bayswater Marsh went out like a light in fifth. Then Hardy Accord and was gone firing. And Fifi was the last one to finish. Shadow play gave up with a couple of fences to go. And a race that changed complexion a few times in the last mile. And Roach did his best to throw it away at the last, but hung on to take it. And Plyne Lukey second. And it's Roach for ball only on the winner. Plyne Lukey, the Martin Leader, was second. Watching carefully for Graham Clutterbuck was third. Watergate for Darren Thompson fourth. And Bayswater March for David Robertson was fifth.